Hi, it's Anika from Living for Later. So today let's talk about what we are doing to pursue our call, um, the call of God on our life. So, um, you know, perhaps you're saying, yes, I know God has called me to something great, or yes, I received this prophetic word, but you're just sitting there and you're not really going after it. You're not really, um, possessing you know what god ha has said concerning you and I, I i'll just use myself a, as an example i know that god um has given me the ability to teach and i started this youtube channel and my blog as a means um to exercise that gift right so now I'm recognizing that God is calling me to an even greater level. So as opposed to in the past where I was just posting, you know, once a month or once every few months, I'm trying to be more aggressive about it because God has been speaking some things into my spirit. So it's not for me to just sit and say, okay, yeah, God called me, told me this, and he promised this, and he promised that he was going to use me in this way. It's I have to put some skin in the game, if you will, and pursue what God has said. It's not just going to just happen right i have to participate with god so my question to you is if you know what your anointing is if you know what your gifting is are you going after it are you pursuing what god has spoken are you just kind of sitting there are there practical things that you can do to kind of fine tune the giftings that god has put inside of you um, which is connected to your purpose is there a class that you could take ha are you pursuing it in, in in prayer and in fasting and in the studying of the word because i recognize that having a gift is one thing but my goodness it's a whole nother level that gift is taken to a whole nother level when you make time um, in prayer and connecting to God, it seems like he just brings out even more of your gifting. So today I'm going to end there, but my call to action is to, after this video, just sit and ask the Lord, what can I do? What are some practical things that I can do? What can I do now to start to pursue what you have said? Instead of just sitting there and saying, oh, I have this gift. God, show me how to go after it, how um, to get the, the wheels turning, if you will. Um, so I'm going to leave you with that today. You be blessed.